Hey there everyone, Hitesh here and welcome to the results of Saturday Coding Challenge. In case you are not aware, on this channel, we host Saturday Coding Challenges in which we invite a lot of people from data structure, algorithms, Android, web, a lot of stuff. And we just give you a challenge, absolutely free, you can take part in it. And then you have to submit the challenge, uh, whatever that is, and based on that we give prize money, uh, some goodies and stuff like that. So we hosted a challenge in the previous video, which was about a nearest die challenge, a challenge which was based heavily on the BST, binary search tree, the balanced one, of course. And um, I asked you to find the nearest stuff about it. So more you can find out in the uh, last video that I asked on the Saturday coding challenge playlist. And we receive a lot of people's uh, solution for that. I asked you that, hey, uh, prepare a presentation on Google presentation, Google Slides, whatever you call that, and just submit your presentation along with the code. This time I didn't ask you that just submit the code, I asked you to prepare a presentation for it. Now, to my surprise, this time I'll, only a few people just took part on it. Uh, that was really surprising because usually a lot number take part. This time it was reduced down to like 50%. Uh, Probably a lot of people just thought that, hey, I'm not going to win. And that's a good news for all of you that who took part in that. So uh, again, there were a lot of people and I would say almost like 40% of them were having the correct solution. That is really nice and congratulations. And by the way, this is a very common question be being asked in the interview as well. But anyways, one had to be winner here. So I did picked up a random uh, selection here this time, as I mentioned in the previous video. And here is our winner. Our winner is Mohammed Farhan from New Delhi. I reached him out on email saying that, hey, your congrats, you are a winner. Uh, send me your contact number. He replied me back along with a nice uh, little like one liner story. And I would like to share it with all of you. Mohammed Farhan is a very dedicated programmer and really a hard worker. I highly, highly appreciate that. He not only did prepare this presentation at like night, in the night, three o'clock, uh, didn't did even record the video at three o'clock. Uh, he told me in the email that my parents are sleeping in the other room. That's why my, my sound is a little bit slow. But as I mentioned, these audio crisp quality and video quality, I don't really care much about in these solutions because you are just a student, not a professional video maker. As long as you are a little bit confident and you are uh, presenting right thing, that's all I care. So really, a person who can just get up at 3 o'clock in the night and can record the videos for taking part in a challenge, he is actually a motivator and we should all learn from it. I am definitely learning a lot from him that if he can be up at the night at late and finish his work, I certainly can learn a lot from him. So there we go. Congratulations, Mohammed Farhan. If you are watching this, hey, you are a great man. I really appreciate you. By the way, I have dropped you an email. You, I know you have sent me your contact number, uh, but also I have replied you back again for one more query that I was having. So please reply back then and uh, congratulations, you are a winner. And probably by the end of the day, we are going to uh, send you your prize money. Okay. Now, one last thing before we end this video, which is very important. Uh, yes, apart from subscribe, I know you have already done that. Now, I would like to invite all of the web developers for the next Saturday Coding Challenge. The next Saturday Coding Challenge is going to be absolutely fun for the web developers. And definitely, there's going to be a ton of competition in that. So be prepared for that. And good news is, there is going to be a prize money, of course. But we have got some goodies as well. For the next challenge, I just got a news that our t-shirts are back in my house. And uh, we do have t-shirts, I write code in case you haven't checked that out. I posted a few photos of that on my Instagram, just scroll it a little bit. I write code t-shirts and the next winner is going to get the t-shirt. So let's discuss more about that in the next Saturday and we'll be throwing up a next Saturday, uh, the coding challenge. So don't wait for, uh, don't miss that out. It is pretty amazing challenge. No, no entry fees and you can take part in that. So hit that subscribe button and uh, let's catch up in the next Saturday coding challenge. And by the way, I hope you're following up my MongoDB series too. Let me know in the comment section if you're following that. So that's it for this video and let's catch up in the next one.